Hello everyone, welcome to another one of my lead code videos. In this video, we'll be doing number 102, binary tree level order traversal. So let's look into it. Uh, the input is a binary tree and we have to output the level order traversal of the tree. So for example, in this tree, the first level has just three. The second level has nine and 20. The third level has 15 and 7. So we output each of the levels as list elements uh, within a bigger list. So the output is a list of lists and the input is a root. So the approach that we're going to take here is we're going to start with the root. Uh, we're going to add this to a list. And then uh, in an inner loop, iterate through that list and then add its children to uh, to another list while adding the the top to the output list. So in the first iteration, we'll add three to the output list and nine and 20 to the children list. And then we'll continue, we'll again iterate. So in the next iteration, nine and 20 will be added to the output list and their children, uh, which is nine, has no children 20 has 15 and 7 as children uh 20 has 15 and 7 as children and 15 and 7 will be then added to the next uh to the children list and 9 and 20 in the output then again we'll go through the children list and repeat the same process so basically we'll uh we'll process the current list adding it to the result and adding its children to a next list and then we'll keep processing the next list until that's empty so let's see what it looks like. So first, let's create our uh, result, which is going basically going to be a, a list of lists. And let me just go ahead and I'm, OK, it's imported. Uh, and at the end, we're going to return this result. So we're going to have two lists. So first list would be let me just put a null check real quick. So if root is null, or if we don't have any tree, uh, let's just return result. Cut that out of the way. And then uh, we're gonna create our list of current or nodes to traverse, right? So this is the nodes that we will be traversing. And the initially our nodes to traverse will just contain the the root and then while not nodes to traverse is empty so while we still have stuff to traverse what we're going to do is we're going to go through each of the nodes to traverse so uh, actually this is supposed to be a tree node so while we go through all the nodes to traverse and if you remember whatever we're traversing we'll add to the result list and its children will add to the next list so um, let's create a result list saying list integer So this is this result list represents one result list and for each node that we traverse we'll add the value to the result list so in the first iteration we'll be adding three in the second iteration we'll be adding nine and twenty and so on and then so this this nodes to traverse is the current uh, the current level but as we traverse it we need to keep adding its children for the next traversal. So uh, I'm going to create another list of tree nodes saying nodes to traverse next, right? So this is going to be the next nodes to traverse. And here we're going to just say result uh, dot add result list. And we'll set our nodes to traverse. Uh, to nodes to traverse next and then here we return result so for what do we put in nodes to traverse next so for each node we traverse we're going to see if it has a left or a right and if it does 
we're going to add it to our nodes to traverse next so this is simply going to be if node dot left is not null then nodes to traverse next dot add node dot left and similarly uh, if node dot right is not null nodes to traverse next dot add node dot right so what this gonna, is going to do is in the first iteration three will be in our result list since that's what we put in our nodes to traverse and yeah three will be added to the result list here and with these nine and twenty will be added to the, into the nodes to traverse next right and then here we add result list which only contains three to the end result and we set our nodes to traverse to nodes to traverse next so in the next iteration nodes to traverse will now contain 9 and 20 so we'll add 9 and 20 to the result list which goes in the end result so that's how 9 and 20 will end up here and then this will add 15 and 7 to the nodes to traverse next so it will see that 9 has no children it won't add anything and it will see 20 has two children 15 and 7 so that will be added to the node to traverse next and and then in the next iteration 15 and 7 will be nodes to traverse next uh, which is nodes to traverse so then the result list will contain 15 and 7 from here and both of them don't have any children so nodes to traverse next will be empty and then nodes to traverse will be set to an empty list when it goes here it will see it's empty so it will and it will then re return the result which contains 3 9 20 and 15 7 so let, let's uh, try to run it so yes it got accepted let's try to submit cool uh, it worked so yeah thank you all for watching and see you in the next video